1968, a famous book came out about Paul Ehrlich, one of the great, great environmentalists that people still worship to this day, that said that hundreds of millions of people were going to die of starvation during the 70s because of overpopulation. It didn't happen. So when I look at these things, these string of failures, I am skeptical. I'm skeptical of what they tell me next about the end of the world. The end of the world ain't happening. Is it possible that you're only keeping out some failures? No, I'd love to hear about the successes. But <laughs> love to sometimes. Asbestos. I'm talking about catastrophic losses. Asbestos. Science okay. said it was poisonous it is. Let me keep going. Now, let's say, let's say that they're right. Let's say the globe is warming. Let's say it's all true. I'll grant you it all. I'll grant you the carbon, that human, the human beings are causing the warming that stopped 14 years ago for some bizarre reason, but 16 years ago. But let's say it's still happening, right? What's the solution? Now, I, I can guarantee you one thing, that the solution cannot be, should not be, must not be, stop using carbon fuels. Because what that actually means is stop living. Because it does. You can laugh. But everything, you can, everything around you is made of carbon, fuel, of oil, of natural gas, the plastic of the chairs you're sitting on, this bottle, this cup. Most of the, most of the synthetics in your clothes are made from carbon. Most of the stuff in this room is made from oil byproducts. Stop using oil. Stop refining oil. I might as well go back. 300 years to when we were all poor, we were all starving, we were all subsistence farming, children died before the age of 10, life sucked. Carbon emissions are created while you refine the oil to create the plastic. Where do you think carbon emissions come from? The whole process is about carbon emissions. You know when you stop emitting carbon? This is where, this is where people, you lose people. You stop emitting carbon when you're dead. Only time when, you, when your footprint is zero. And I guess some people like that. They want us to have a zero footprint. Yes. 